This is a great question because like this person, I was always taught if you didn't say in Jesus' name at the end of the prayer. In Jesus' name, amen. It didn't count. But like so many things in American Christianity today, this is not the meaning of what we're reading in the Bible when Jesus said, what you ask in my name, you will receive. We have to understand the Bible as what it meant to the first century writers who wrote it and the first century audience who would read it. Jesus was a spiritual teacher. And in those days in first century Palestine, to follow a teacher meant you lived a life in the name of that teacher. That means your life would display the attributes of the teachings of that teacher. If you followed teacher Bob, you would be a Bobian teacher Fred, a Fredian. And theoretically, Jesus Christ is followed by Christians, or what we now call Christians. So to add in Jesus' name at the end of a prayer doesn't make the prayer valid or invalid. The point is, when you're expressing a need to God, whatever that God looks like to you, it needs to be done with a sincerity of heart and done so within alignment of the belief system which you espouse. And sadly, many people who say in Jesus' name at the end of their prayers aren't actually those who look like they follow the teachings of Christ and therefore are not Christians. And no, just adding in Jesus' name at the end of a prayer as some sort of magic incantation doesn't improve your chances of something happening in your life. Nor does not saying it invalidate the prayer and the cry of your heart. It is the prayer given with a pure heart that draws good things to us, not some magic words.